uncharted my soul will embark and I follow your voice straight into the dark and if from the course you intend I sails of my wandering heart. Through waters uncharted, my soul will embark. And I follow your voice straight into the dark. And if from the course you intend I depart Speak to the sails of my wandering heart Like the wind you guide Clear the skies before me in the shallows amidst fear and fall your truth is a compass that points me back north Jesus my captain my soul's trusted Lord and all my allegiance is rightfully yours. Lost in the shallows amidst fear and fall. Your truth is a compass that points me back north. Oh, Jesus, my captain, my soul's trust in love.
my soul will embark And I'll follow your voice straight into the dark And if from the course you intend I depart Speak to the sails of my
every step is sure with you every step is sure with you every step is sure with you Every step is sure with you. Every step is sure with you. Every step is sure with you, oh Jesus. Every step is sure with you. Every step. Every step is sure with you, oh Jesus. Jesus, my full assurance, oh Jesus.
You search my thoughts You open my path Jesus You know my ways You search my Jesus, for nothing is hidden from you. Oh God, nothing is hidden from you. Nothing is hidden from you. Nothing is hidden from you. Jesus, you know the end from the beginning, you know my ways, Jesus, you know From the beginning, you know all my ways, you know all my paths, you read every thought, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. search me Lord you have known me Lord you know when I sin you know when I rise you perceive every thought from afar you search me Lord you know my You know when I rise, perceive every thought from afar. Oh, you discern my going out and my lying down. Oh, you are well acquainted with all 
my ways, with all my ways. And before a word is on my tongue, before a line is on my tongue, oh, before a song is on my tongue, you know we can please. Completely God, you know it completely God. Every word, every thought, every song, you know it completely God. Oh, every word, every line. Every thought, you know it completely, God. You know it completely, God. You know it completely, God. your presence oh, where can I hide from you oh God oh you know it all you see it all oh where your spirit and where can I flee from your presence where can I hide from you oh God you find me in the high Find me in the depths. You find me in the heights. You find me in the depths. Oh, where can I go? Where can I hide? Where can I flee? presence here in your presence here you cover me in your presence here
can I flee from your presence? When you hear me in behind and before, you hear me in behind and before, you hear me in behind and before.
Rise, my soul rests in your embrace, for I am yours. You are mine. You are mine.
Speak all I need. 
not hidden from you when I was made in the secret place. My frame was not hidden from you when I was made in the secret place. You knit me together
You know every detail of our lives. You know every intricate thoughts in our minds. You know every emotion in our hearts, and we thank you that you know us deeply and you love us deeply. And we are known and loved to that extent. We thank you, Father, that we have this relationship with you, God, where we can approach you with full confidence to your throne. Transition into a time of intercession for the year 2017. This morning we'll be praying for prayer and intercession. I invite you to follow with your own prayers after my prayers. Jesus, you command us to abide in you and you invite us into deeper levels of intimacy. We ask you, Holy Spirit, to highlight any sin in our hearts so that it may be removed and that we may draw closer to the Father. We also ask that you reveal your heart to us, reveal your desires, your plans, and your thoughts to us. We want to draw close to you with clean hands and a pure heart and pray for things that are on your, uh, that are on your heart. Strengthen us, Lord, to continuously abide in you as we pray this year. Let's pray.
Holy Spirit, give us a fresh revelation of who Christ is and His glory. Give us a greater capacity to understand how deep His love is for us. And from that place, would you help us surrender our lives to Christ once again, declaring in faith that He is the way, the truth, and the life, and that besides Him we cannot approach the Father. We ask that through this revelation, our confidence and authority will grow in our intercession and prayers, and that we will take our place as co-heirs with Christ. Let's pray.
Thank you, Father, for your grace that helps us to pray with perseverance through the Holy Spirit. We confess that our flesh is weak, but God, our spirits are willing. Help us keep alert and keep our lamps burning in the year 2017. Help us regard prayer as a privilege and a duty and not a burden. Fill us with your joy as we pray and intercede for others. We ask for fresh grace this year because we know that we cannot grow weary in prayer, especially in light of everything that is happening in the world. Let's pray.
Lord, we lift up all the prayer movements of local churches across this nation and across the world. We pray for a revival and a fresh outpouring of your spirit upon each prayer movement. If there are any that are on the verge of dying or being compromised, we ask that you pour out new hope and unity in the churches. Give us a fresh understanding of the power of prayer and how pleasing it is to you to see your people gather and seek your face. God, we want to see many more prayer movements and houses rise up to keep the incense burning this year. Let's pray.
Father, we thank you that through Jesus we, may, we can approach your throne and that we have the authority to bind and to loose things on earth and in heaven. You have given us the authority to, to rule and to reign with Christ. And Father, I pray for a fresh fire to fill our own personal prayer lives, God, and for the prayer movements across our churches and in this nation. Father, we ask that you give us a fresh understanding of the power in our prayers, that we will have the, the desire and the joy to pray and to intercede on the behalf of those who cannot. And Father, we pray for your grace, God, and for your, for your spirit to be upon each person as we, as we enter 2017 with a new heart and with a new mind. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Father, for this relationship that we have with you and for the privilege we have to, to commune with you, God. We thank you, Lord, and we pray all these things in Jesus' name. Overflow in this place, fill our hearts with your love, your love surrounds us. And you're the reason we came to encounter your love, your love surrounds us. Overflow in this place, fill our hearts with your love. on us we need your presence your kingdom come your will be done here as in heaven spirit of God fall fresh on
Holy Spirit, we just thank you for your closeness. You make all things possible. stepping into a year that is filled with faith a year where we do not neglect what you've said is important where we do not become people that are so busy and so occupied doing so many things that we forget you've called us into a place of prayer you've called us into a place of worship called us to set aside time to seek your face to know who you are father we thank you that you're calling us into things that are way above our heads that are way beyond what we are able to do on our own strength and you call us Lord God to depend on prayer that we would be qualified that we would be sustained throughout this year of accomplishing all the things that you've set us to do. I pray, Father, that you strengthen us in the place of prayer. That we find ourselves, or God, on our knees. Not from a place of pride, not from a place of entitlement or self-sufficiency, but simply asking in humility that you would be a God who moves supernaturally in our lives this year. We thank you, God. We trust in where you are leading us, even more often, what God, we cannot see. We trust, God, that you are leading us and you are guiding us where we need to go. We trust in you. We thank you, Father. We pray all these things in Jesus' name.